so Todd has found him a little peace, has he? I realize that it does sound like a stretch, but his attitude towards me was totally different. <laughs> Mom, I told you he did sound really different the last time I talked to him. Okay, 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 okay. As long as it lasts and as long as it's real. <laughs> did somebody in here just have a baby? You bet. Uh, yes. Your wife has a beautiful, healthy baby girl to raise. Girl. That's good news. That's very good news. That's the best. <laughs> Mike, I am so happy. I'm so happy. Oh, Hope. I'm so sorry. This is not your fault. Of course it is. It's payback. Todd wanted me to tell his daughter her baby was dead, and I agreed. And now she's dead. But, but he didn't follow through on this. Oh, my God. What am I going to tell those poor people? I just told them she was fine. What am I going to say? All right. You're going to have to make yourself scarce. Oh, I was planning to do that anyway. I'm going to... I have to figure out some way to explain this. Oh, my God. Look, I, I, if there's anything I can do, I just go. I'll take care of this. This shouldn't have happened. I must have missed something. No, no, I don't know what you could have. This delivery was routine. Her lungs were clear. Her heart was strong. <gasps> I held her. <gasps> She was fine. She's not fine now. Star will suffer, knowing that you're gone. The woman was going to adopt you or suffer as well. But the man that was going to kidnap you, Todd Manning, changed his mind. But he's still your grandfather. If he had a heart, I'm sure he'd suffer. But I don't think he does. But we don't care about any of them. All we care about is Jessica. I hope Jared and Natalie survived. They didn't deserve what Tess did to them. Although she'll never admit it. That's Jessica's burden now. She'll blame herself. Add to the pile of grief she'll feel when she comes back out. It'll be as if Nash died all over again. But that's why you're here. To keep her busy, she'll have to take care of you and your sister, Bree. And in time, she'll recover. You'll see. I don't understand why it's taking so long to find anything out. All right, Dr. Joplin disappears. We send Dr. McBain to find something out. He disappears. I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with the adoption papers, you know? things that have to be we, signed. We don't even know if Star's had the baby or not. I, I can't wait here any longer. Wait, where are you going? To get some answers. They would tell us if something was wrong, right? Yes, of course they would. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I haven't seen you smile like this since, well, since Tommy. Can you stay? Oh, Mike, they're about to bring her back, and I would just love for you to see her. She's so gorgeous. Yeah, well, where is she? Is she in the nursery? No, no, no. Uh, Dr. Joplin thought that something was wrong, so they took her to NICU, but... Yeah, but then she came back and said that everything was yeah. fine, but what has been taking her so long? See, that's where you come in, doctor. <laughs> go, Paige, Dr. Yeah. Joplin. Bring yes. her I'm going to go okay. see where she is. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> waiting a long time. <laughs> Dr. Jonklin, where's Hope? I am so sorry. What, what do you mean? Where's the baby? I don't quite know what happened. Dr. Jonklin, where is the baby? She's gone. I can't explain it. She was fine. 
What do you mean she's gone? You mean that... You mean that she's back in the NICU? That's what you mean, isn't it? No, Michael, no! Oh, my God, Mom! Sir, sir! No, she can't be gone! Michael, she can't be gone! No! Baby, I'm so sorry, No, no, Michael, no! Please, don't tell me that she's gone! She'll figure out where Tess went to. They'll be here soon. We better get ready. You're about to start your new life. It's okay. It's okay, Mama's right here. Mama is right here for you. I'm right here, girl. Okay. What happened? Apparently, my initial uh, concern about the baby's viability was correct. But she appeared to stabilize, which is why I came back in here with the good news, and I am so sorry mm. that I did that. But then she, she arrested. How can a hospital full of doctors get it so wrong? I am so sorry. I don't want to be sorry. I want to know why. My daughter was healthy. Her boyfriend was healthy. She had a healthy pregnancy. I heard that baby, that baby was healthy. He was crying, was bawling his eyes out. Now you tell me, it doesn't make any sense here, doctor. Believe me, it doesn't make sense to me. Look, I... my husband, my ex-husband and I donated a million dollars worth of equipment to that unit. There were top-notch doctors here. How could you, how could you let a baby that went to full term, was breathing on its own, die? What are you telling me here? Oh, God, I cannot believe she's gone. I can't believe hope is gone. Listen to me. I cannot bring your baby back, but I'm certainly going to get you some answers, okay? I'm going to get you some answers. Oh, my God.